Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, glory, and honor be unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rechah HaKodash. Double honors to the elders and the apostles of the great millstone who taught us this truth. Salutations to the hopefully elect out there pushing this word in truth, sincerity, and indeed. And your brother Kapat Desai from the great millstone Chicago branch. Coming at you with another quick, Lord willing, edifying lesson. And um, this is just going to be very quickly. Um, not going to really get too deep. Shit, I still ain't even seen the movie. However, through the spirit, all right, the spirit of the Lord is revealing Esau's wickedness, okay? All right, I'm lambacking off that same spirit, that same uh, uh, sentiment that the elder Mawatazak, all right, out there in LA, as well as the elder, uh, um, as well as the elder Yashawamba out there in Dallas, and basically just bring into light that the main reason that Esau is pushing this movie, making this movie so controversial, uh, <laughs> starting petitions to pay it forward so people can go see it for free is not because esau wants to shed light and uh, uh, uh rectify this horrible 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 crimes of uh child sex trafficking okay they don't want to stop it they don't want to put an end to it if they wanted to they have all the money all the resources and all the wherewithal to do the to uh put this shit all right to an end overnight OK, if he really wanted to, he could do it, but he doesn't want to. All right. This is not only a billion dollar industry. He's going to use this movie to play on the minds. All right. As a psyop to play on the minds and the emotions of the people to do what? Ultimately get people microchipped. All right. So like I'm outside. Let that damn train go past. Salaki, I'm outside occupant. But yeah, ultimately, that's what Esau wants to do. Okay, so what is he gonna do? He he it's problem, reaction, solution. Okay, ordo ab chao, order out of chaos. So what does he do? He presents the problem, all right? Child sex trafficking, right? Um he creates the uh, uh reaction. The reaction is hey, we're gonna make this movie. All right. We're going to get people stirred up. We're going to get people's emotions just so involved. It's going to cloud their judgment. Right. And then what does he do? He comes back at you with the solution here. Well, you microchip your pets, start microchipping your children, mic microchip each other. It's not enough that uh, these cell phones have tracking devices in it. No, 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 no. We need to put it in you for your safety. See, and that's just that's how this devil operates. This is Second Corinthians, chapter two, verse 11. It says, lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. All right, fuck it, I'm gonna just talk through it. But yeah, we're not ignorant of his devices. We're not ignorant of your plots, your schemes, and your mischief, Esau. Okay? You see, these people are, these, these clones out here, they, they may be ignorant to the devices, but the men of the Lord, okay, being endowed with the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, are going to shed light on your wickedness and warn the flock and rebuke you to your face. All right. And this, this is wicked as hell. Like I said, you control this Esau. You control this. Okay. Don't think that uh, uh, Mel Gibson is just so compelled to make a change in the world, to do good in the world. Don't think this guy, Jim Caviezel, which played, uh, uh, which played Caesar Borgia and Passion of the Christ, right? Don't think this guy is just so moved with compassion that he wants to make a difference and save the children. No, these guys are all in on it. They're all behind it. Damn, the bitch fine. They're all behind it, all right? They're all in on it, okay? And like I said, this is just order out of, cha uh, order out of chaos. This is another uh, uh, psyop to play upon the minds and emotions of the people because what? These people in the world... All right. There's nothing more precious to them than the children. You see, these people, they, they put children, money. They put everything above Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, the God of heaven and earth. All right. They put their own emotions. OK. And their own uh, uh, point of view and opinions above Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. So guess what? When you make a play on the things that they hold near and dear to them, they're going to bend the knee to whatever you throw at them. Whatever you think uh, or whatever they think is going to safeguard them. All right. And, and keep them safe. They're going to they're going to be down with it, man. They're going to give into it. And this is just another play of that. All right. Esau, he's not he's not being the good guy. He didn't just wake up one day. <laughs> all right. And decide to try to make the world a better place. 
all right that's just not in his mo this is uh the book of sirach chapter matter of fact before i get that okay because this man's always been the devil all right this is uh jeremiah chapter 13 verse 23 it reads can the ethiopian change his skin or the leopard his spots then may ye also do good that are accustomed to do evil see this devil he's accustomed to do evil this devil is the reason why all right <laughs> you have slaves and, and child child sex slaves all right not only in america but abroad okay because what esau does is he, he 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 man he tortures and sexually abuses children and they 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 film it and they upload the contents onto the dark web and these fucking perverts they get off they get aroused by seeing this okay this, this devil all right as the scriptures say his his spirit is not upright in him all right a lot of these devils are, are in the bdsm all right they're masochists sadists they get off on watching people be put in, in, in pain all right they get off on that shit okay this this, this this man is bugged out and he has to be stopped okay he has to be stopped all right this this is high level witchcraft all right and these people are, are merciless murderers of children all right pursuing back to that wisdom of solomon i believe the 12th chapter okay so this, this guy's through nonetheless this is a uh, ecclesiastes uh, sirach chapter 14 verse 5 he that is evil to himself to whom will he be good he shall not take pleasure in his goods right see it's not just uh, uh it's a lot of israelite children are falling victim to this especially northern and southern kingdom all right but but hell even his own other edomite children all right are being subject to this torture and imprisonment and this trafficking you see esau ain't discriminating but he really wants you israelite children he really he really has it out for us man all right he, he, he is hell bent on making our people suffer. All right. Verse six, there is none worse than he that envieth himself. And this is a recompense of his wickedness, right? Because this, this damn devil, he can't have enough, man. He can't have enough. You know, is his covetousness is his curse. He has to have more. He has to have more. You know, you got to be a sick motherfucker. Here it is, Esau. You own everything. You got the whole world at your palms, right? But you just... You could have any any you could have any grown woman you wanted of any flavor any nationality but no you want some kids you want children you know you want little boys you want uh you want to turn little boys into catamites man you know and then when you're done abusing them and using them all right you then mutilate them and sell their organs on the black market to a bunch of old edomites you know old jethro you know hey his, his kidneys going out he needs a uh, open heart surgery right away all right where you think they getting all these organs from for these super rich people they're coming from children it's just facts all right but nonetheless i'm gonna keep going verse seven is the point and if he doeth good he doeth it unwillingly and at the last he will declare his wickedness see so this devil bringing out this movie you think they're trying to do good nah man this is unwilling this is all a part of a plot this is all a psyop this is all a part of the grand scheme of things to get people microchipped man so they can track you all right they're gonna use safety they're gonna use uh you know what i mean they want you to safeguard your children from predators so we have to be able to track them okay we can't rely on cell phones because they could just throw the cell phone, you know what I mean, across the road, snatch a child. No. All right. So for the safety of your toddlers, for the safety of your teen daughters, for the safety of your grandfather with Alzheimer's, we got to implant them. OK, so we can keep up with them. And that's Esau at the at the last declaring his wickedness, man. All right. And that's what this is all about. That's the overlay for the underlay as to why they coming out with this fucking movie. But nonetheless you know i'm gonna wrap it up there hope this is edifying all praise glory and honor be unto you how about shimmy how shy shalom the bubble ball